Hello and welcome to another Minecraft video. Right, short and sweet. Last last video, I uh, we I dug out all of this in here, and now it is time to decorate it and feel more homey instead of like a boxed out cave. So, first of all, let's just go and grab a load of materials. Actually, but first of all. I am going to make myself a brand new pickaxe and possibly a new axe because I think that might help. Let's just grab everything. Right, I can make a stone axe and another pickaxe. Right, so that's us sorted. Right. Cool. Okay, let's keep them in there for now. Right, I... right now let's go. Maybe set that back. Let's sleep. Man, my bed is in here. Right. This shouldn't take too long. Okay, right. As long as uh, I can get my house done today, I might be able to start making more rooms everywhere inside. But I would like to do like an anodite, a polished andesite floor with oak, with like oak um, walls. Yeah, zombies here, there, and everywhere. So I feel like they are beneath me. Oh no, there's a spawner in there. Okay, right, so that's, that's good to know. I suppose. So, let's just keep... I'm going to grab as much as I can. Because I want this to try and make... Look, make this look as nice as I possibly can. Well, that was cobblestone. Don't particularly need that, but I'm kind of hoping that in a second that I should just have enough. Okay, 36, 37, make that. Okay, right, let's head, head back up and then we can make all this into polished and see how it goes. Because this whole episode is just making, or this whole video, should I say, is just making my house look more homey than just like a regular old box. Right. I know probably 36 isn't going to be enough, but I have got some more down here and probably some up above me on the ceiling. Um, that can go in there. Right. I always forget how to make. There we go. Right. No? Okay. Let's chuck all this in there. I had to make it again. Okay, cool. Right. Cool. Make as much as we can. So that is obviously 36. So, and I've got one left over, which can just go in here. So first of all, let's just start digging out the floor. I'm gonna have a load of cobblestones. I don't particularly know what I'm gonna do with it. And that is a cave. Fair enough. Right. Let's just start just removing the whole of the floor. What I will do, I will actually be back once I have the floor fully completed. So I'll be right back. Right, so the floor's done. Well, that's, that's the floor done. I've just got to do the four walls now. 
and then I might leave the seed in stone just depending on how it goes just change that to stone just because it might actually look alright but if I want to change it in the end I probably will but I'll just see how time goes but the floor is now fully done that's got to go and get the materials for the walls and then that should be the house done all I've got to do is decorate it and get everything else done so without any further ado let's go out and get all of the oak that I need they shouldn't be too painful that took a lot longer than I thought it would doing all of the walls because quite frankly I thought I would have had enough uh, andesite to begin with but clearly not but at the end they remove you can't exactly oh it's the vines yeah you can't um, predict everything you can't anticipate everything but at the end they've done it so it's just let's just get my the uh the first room done and then the more and more we do we can get moving And it is honestly just going night time. So that's how long it has taken me. I did sleep through. Well, I had to sleep once um, while doing the floor. But now, see, this should actually move a lot quicker now. I'm using stone. I don't like to waste um, equipment, but if it means getting wood. I might have to have to keep my eyes peeled now because I know you're going to get all the zombies and. All the mobs trying to come and kill me. But let's call that enough for now. And let's just go back and start. Or sleep then start. House is up there. I didn't go too well. Let's go up an easier route. Uh, there we go. Cool. Right, let's sleep first and then let's start on the next day. Right. I know I keep saying right, but right, let's get moving. Make all of these into planks. So let's put them in there. Let's make them some more. And that's clicking, is probably going to get me nervous by the end of this uh, video or series, whatever you want to call it. Right, so. All four walls are going oak. So now let's just start on a random wall. I've already been in there, there's nothing in there. As long as we get this done today, I know it's going to be one of them like slow progressing series that is going, going to seem to drag on for like ages and ages and ages. But I suppose if, if you enjoy watching them, then I enjoy making them. And if you do want me to do uh, more, if you want me to do more videos or have got any other video ideas for me to do, just leave them down in the comments and I'll, uh, I'll give them some thought and I will possibly do them. Let's fill that in. And then the quicker we get this done. I have a sneaking suspicion that this that the wood we got isn't going to be enough. Just because of how much um, cobblestone we got. I need another axe. Big axe. There we go, look, I'm gonna need some sticks. Right, four will be enough for now. Let's 
because it's going to be like the little things that are going to just waste materials. Just constantly getting sticks. I've worked it out right, it should be a stack per wall, more maybe just less. But that's not bad for a first wall. I know I've left this top bit here because it has just got my torch on. So let's slap that in and put that back in place. Right, should we do this back wall? Get this back wall done and then see how it goes. any point doing I'll do these behind here and what there's no point me wasting materials if you can't see them two blocks. So I'll see if you did see my video uh, yesterday or whenever it was posted. Uh, make sure to check it out if you did like it please uh, like subscribe and obviously comment if you want me to do more. But, like I say every video, and like I said a minute ago, if you don't want me to do more videos, obviously just leave them in the comments and uh, I'll think about doing them. Because I have done, there's nothing stopping me. I think this is what could be the most annoying part for you guys watching is the constant clicking of the mouse. Because my mic is right above where my mouse is. And my mouse isn't the most silent list of things. Unfortunately. So there's two walls done already. So it didn't take long. We've still got, what, 49. Um, no. Work out the mass because I failed, so have fun. 59 blocks left of wood. So I'm hoping that we can get all of the walls done. I think it tends to be these longer walls that take up most of the supplies. Right, yes I know there's a hole in the ceiling, uh, it's just because obviously where I started digging my house. I know I went just extremely silent for a second then I was trying to get it done. So. Right, so, yeah, so we've only got 29 left. Might get this wall done, but I'm not hoping for much. Could even get the next wall done, in all fairness. But yeah, no, I'll take that back, you've got no chance. Right, so. Pick up the torches. Back to where they need to be. Pick that up and then put one back where it should be, which is up here. All right, so we've got seven left. All right, we can at least start digging out this wall. I'm only going to dig out for as much as I need. So how many is that? Uh, five, six, seven. That's not like we need excessive amounts of 
digging. But I do need to patch this wall up out here. Otherwise you're gonna see the wood for it. And while I'm out here I am also going to patch this up. I know it's gonna look a bit ugly but That's what, it'd look better if it was stone, but you know, I haven't actually got any stone yet. So that is stone right here. Okay, right, last bits of wood, and then I think that would be it then. Call it a day. I might just grab 20, maybe more. Um, grab some trees. best looking biome to be getting wood or or to be even living next to but I suppose it's not where you live it's how you make your house or how you decorate your house because you could be living in the, like, the worst area possible but your house could be like the most like the best one that stands out I said I might get more than 20, but I'm hoping 20 does it. Gets me, uh, gets me enough to finish off my house. Right. I'm hoping this is enough. Chuck it all in there. Oh, yeah, there we go. Yeah, I've got more than enough. The dust. Uh, not one. No, oh, I'm done. There you go. Right. Nearly done. Just nearly there. And then this room will be done and dusted. Where it needs to be. I'm hoping I don't need my axe. As long as I just take my time with it. Do it piece by piece. Saying that, I'm hoping I don't need my axe. I go and place the block in the wrong position. Where it doesn't even need to be. is completed so I know I didn't I know I didn't I wanted to get a lot more done I wanted to get at least this partially decorated in here or at least another room kind of done but obviously playing survival is time consuming because you have to go and get all the pieces yourself you've got to destroy everything it's not like you can just sit in creative and fly around and do everything but I think on that note I'm going to end it there. I'll just end it there with a the sunset in the background. So if you did like... Yeah, so if you did like, um, please like, subscribe, and peace.